Hello everybody and welcome back to Mass Effect 2 Legendary Edition where today we're gonna check our mail uh, and then we're gonna do Shadow Broker DLC team status everybody alive heck yeah no new messages nobody cares that I saved the world well the Cerber Cerberus man the elusive man is uh, really angry with me but I've also refused to receive communication from him uh, hang on, wait, 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 let me test out, before I forget, I can't remember, do I gotta go like, I'm gonna go talk to Thane and see if any, if you can invite him up to your room, I swear, I swear, man, unless they took it out, I swear there's, there's a scene where you're just like laying in bed together, which is like sweet, right, like this doesn't like, gratuitous. Also, we just survived a suicide mission. You had to make a difficult choice, Siha, for what it's worth. I believe you made the correct one. Thank you. I think I... I don't know if he's the only one that says... Whoever your romance is might be the only one who says anything about it, but... Have a few minutes to talk? You needn't ask. Time for me is short, Siha. But any I have is yours to take. How are you feeling? No worse than ever. You needn't worry. And you? Hmm. You are well. All right. No need to worry about me. How are you holding up? I'm looking forward to the end of the mission. It has been many years since I felt I could relax anywhere. We owe ourselves a memorable vacation. We should pick a destination. There must be some travel brochures in the ship's computer. I would very much like to see a desert. I also can't believe that he hasn't seen one. Unless he has, and he just would like to see it again. But... He's been all over the galaxy. I was just thinking about. Oh you. yeah, thanks. I heard about you and uh, Thane. I want to. Uh, Actually, no, I don't. But I'm glad you're happy. Thank you. Good thing you broke up that cat fight between Jack and Miranda. I was afraid they'd tear a hole in the hole. I have to say. That's that right. Mm -hmm. He seems pretty intense. I wonder if he likes Japanese girls with a penchant for kleptomania. I'm glad we're all moving past our previous traumas and previous loves and uh, looking at others. Come back later. I'm sure I'll have more to talk there, about. Here, I'm Let's go see. And because I wasn't able to rescue the crew, um, the ship will remain empty. Except Chakwas. We can go see how Chakwas. I wanted to tell you, I believe you did the right thing by destroying that base. The elusive man thinks he has the wisdom to utilize it, but he does not. See, this is all I need. Just those two to be like, I think you made the right decision. And I'm like, thank you, my very zen killers. I appreciate it very much. I thought we could chat a bit. I would like that. You have been a good friend to me. Oh, okay. More conversation? That means a lot to me. If we both still live when this is done, you may call upon me for aid at any time. I will come for you, Shepard. Thanks. I could have. I guess I should have talked to her before the main mission. I thought I had gotten everything, but I guess not. But everybody's kind of deep. There's no like after after mission. You know, default dialogue. It's all. I'm sorry, Commander. I need some time to get my thoughts in order. Yeah, she should. She should be like laying down. Also, we keep we're keeping a Geth here and here with her. An interesting choice, Shepard Commander. Your species was offered everything Geth aspire to: true unity, understanding, transcendence. You rejected it. You even refused the possibility of using the old machine's gifts to achieve it on your species' own terms. You are more like us than we thought. I mean, this is kind of what he said before, or what it said before about, um... Like, the, the split between the Geth and the heretics. Was that the heretics wanted things handed to them, but the Geth did not, you know? I'd like to find out more about you. Topic. 
When we took you aboard, I noticed you have a piece of N7 yes. armor welded to you. Where'd you get it? It was your... Wow. When you disappeared, we were sent to find you. We began where you first encountered the heretics. Eden Prime. After the old machine's attack, it was heavily defended. We were discovered. This is the impact of a rifle shot. You've been looking for me for two years? We visited Therum, Pharos, Novaria, Vermeer, Ilos. A dozen unsettled worlds. The trail ended at Normandy's wreckage. You were not there. Organic transmissions claimed your death. We recovered this debris from your hard suit. The Geth are listening in on our transmissions? Organic life reacts to stimuli in unpredictable ways. We wish to learn. What do you mean by stimuli? We placed a fabricated story on the extranet. Oh. A arrangement of stars <laughs> viewed from the Batarian homeworld formed the face of a Salarian goddess. Without waiting for verification, some declared a proof of the goddess's existence. Those who noted the lack of proof were attacked. The arguments taught us much. The experiment ended when a Salarian cult tried to purchase colonization rights to the stars and found they did not exist. Nice. It sounds like you're running experiments on us. You are sapient life, but not like us. If we can model organic behavior, we can comprehend the Quarian creators. We do not understand their judgments in the morning war. What do you mean by stimuli? Oh wait, no, you know. We placed a with the arguments taught us. Oh, this reaction. Sounds like you're running. If we we do not understand their judgments in the morning. What's the war. morning war? The conflict between the Geth and the Quarian creators. The war fought at the dawn of our intelligence. It concluded with the departure of the Creator migrant fleet. Yeah, well, <laughs> did, uh, yeah, there's a little more than that. <laughs> Why were you trying to contact me? You opposed the heretics, those that took the old machines as gods. Yeah. All kinds of organics fought Sovereign and his Geth allies. Why am I so interesting? You were the most successful. You killed their god. You succeeded where others did not. Your code is superior. My code is superior. That's why Cerberus brought me back too. That doesn't explain why you used my armor to fix yourself. There was a <laughs> But why didn't you fix it sooner, or with something else? No data available. Mmm. It admired me. So I do have some more conversations to do with people. That's cool, that's nice. That I'll be able to keep doing that. A little bit. Besides just the, you know, after, after mission conversations. Probably not gonna start Shadow Broker today. <laughs> Unless this goes quick. For Sarah, now the collectors. Remind me never to get on your bad side, Shepard. I almost feel sorry for the Reapers. Talk to you later, Garrus. I'll be here if you need me. My guy! For some reason I thought I was still in a cutscene. Um, no. His voice is just so, like, it's so good. It's like everything is right in the world when Garrus is there, you know? Like everything everything is as it should be. We had to do it, Shepard. Taking down the collector base was the oh, right decision. Oh, you agree. The elusive man might not agree, but we had no choice. We we actually did. We really that that was why it was a choice, you know? Do you have a minute, Miranda? There's a lot to do, Shepard. Maybe another Also, time. I'll let you work. We don't. Of course, we Commander. don't really go into. If you kind of side with Cerberus, like it's fine. It's fine for Miranda and Jacob to be here, but they're technically so is actually um, Chuckles and Joker right now are technically Cerberus operatives. So them being on this ship with me still is uh, is a little bit suspect, you know. Like uh, for the serve for Cerberus, like for the elusive man, he'd be like, "Hey, come back, my operatives," and they're like, mm, "No," and he's like. Eh, you know. Let's go. We'll poke Zaid, cause he all you can do is poke him like Kasumi. Back for more. I was shadowing this rookie on an infiltration run to an eclipse base on Tatus. Good kid, but he had no business handling a rifle. 
In the shuttle on the way down, he puked in his helmet. We hit some turbulence, and with all the crap sloshing around, uh. he thought he'd been shot in the head. Went back to the Alliance. Here he's a governor now. Uh, that's horrifying. One time, we were trying to clear out this gun nest outside a base on Vatar. Nothing we did even made a dent in that thing. Someone had the bright idea to kidnap a local girl, strap grenades on her, and make her go seduce the guy in the bunker. Terrible thing, I tell you. Well, she went up there, knocked on the door, and nothing. Grenades never went off. But the guy stopped shooting, and we snuck by. Never found out what happened. What? What? Well, you just let that happen? <laughs> I should let you go. Yeah, he's not like, I mean, he is, I can see the similarity where Joker's like, oh, who's like you? But also, no, absolutely not. Only if you're a renegade shepherd, maybe. Hey. Oh. We, what's happening? You got a lot of questions, don't you? Uh, is this gonna, is this gonna be bad? I miss your friendly nature when you're not okay. around. I've been thinking. We've seen a lot of shit together now, and you're always coming to talk to me. It's just... I'm not really a girl's club kind oh, of person. Oh, yeah. I like you, all right? That's a good place to stop. I don't know why... So it always leads you to that path, then, if you're nice to Jack? Uh, It's like, listen, Jack, I'm dating... I'm, I'm romantically involved with Thane. Like, why is it gotta... Why is it always gotta boil down to that? Maybe the developers just assumed that anybody looking at Jack would be trying to, like... I don't know, take advantage of her? Like, sleep with her? I don't know. Take advantage of her... Of her uncaring, you know, facade. Hey. Okay, bye. I should go. Whatever. But hang on, let me... Let me actually just try this again. Hey. What's happening? Shepard, we talked enough. You're just pissing around. No hard feelings, but I don't want to play. I should go. Whatever. I don't know. I, I apparently don't navigate the Jack conversation very well. Or they just put bad buoys up, you know what I mean? <laughs> like, there's no, not a navigational issue, just a, 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 an issue with the conversation itself, with the landscape itself, you know? I can't believe we destroyed the collector base. They said it couldn't be done. Then again, that's said about a lot of things you do. Have you got time to talk? I really need to clean up this engine. Maybe later? I think we're good. I'll let you work. Talk to you later. Okay. So apparently, like, Samara and Jack kinda had some extraneous dialogue. There it is. So there's my normal shuttle right there. I can't forget to do this. And there's that dang nab stupid DLC machine over there. <laughs> oh, my son. My son is over here. My boy. He's probably stoked, honestly. We fought a great battle, Shepard. And when you blew up the base instead of handing it to Cerberus, ha! <laughs> Something to think about. If you kill the most dangerous thing in the galaxy, that leaves us. Interesting. I hadn't thought about it like that, but yeah. I could, I, I guess I could see how people would see me as a threat, like in the same way in Dragon Age, like the Inquisitor like saves everybody and then after like two years of peace is seen as a threat to like stability. Just checking in. How are you doing? Battlemaster, I have everything. Clan, kin, and enemies to fight. That's all for now. Shepherd. We're all so beautiful. Like, I just, every time I see this game and I'm like, wow. And I'm so glad I actually went back and watched a tiny bit of my Mass Effect 2 playthrough and I was trying to figure something out. Um, like, figure out a decision I'd made and, and realize, like, how truly fortunate we are to have this. And with all the DLCs integrated, it's phenomenal. I love it. Collectors destroyed, base in ruins. Extremely impressive. Thank you. Elusive man will be displeased. Fortunately, not human myself. Not my problem. Have you got a minute to talk? Yes. Personal matters on mind, actually. Got call from nephew. Promising geneticist himself. Just turned 16. Got tenure at university. Following in my footsteps. Had to lie about what I was doing. Think he was suspicious. Doesn't matter. Still good to hear his voice. Your nephew got tenure at 16? Is he a genius or a scientific prodigy? 
No, wait. Don't want to insult him. Yes, uh, but not in manner you meant. Remember, Salarian lives short, but you're rapidly by your standards. Don't live much past 40. Mm -hmm. Are you calling him because you're worried we won't Oopsie make Daisy. Back? No, aware survival unlikely, but actually contacted him for family connection. Hard to imagine, Galaxy. Too many people, faceless. Statistics easy to depersonalize. Good when doing unpleasant work. For this fight, want personal connection. Can't anthropomorphize Galaxy, but can think of favorite nephew. Fighting for him. Dang, I should have. I, I could have sworn. Man, I guess I didn't, obviously, but I could have sworn I went through and talked to people, but um, at the end of like doing all the like running around, checking the galaxy stuff, but it's okay. This didn't really, obviously, didn't affect the outcome of the suicide mission. Does anyone in your family know about what you really did for the government? No. No, I'm lying, but won't pry. Salarian's curious as a people, but also have social cues. Keep two types of secrets from family. First type, personal or guilt-based. Invite suspicion, exploration, <laughs> puzzle to be solved. Reward for curiosity, intelligence, drama. Other secrets, more serious. Dangerous, if discovered. Signals discourage curiosity for protection of family. Why wouldn't everyone give clues that their secrets were too dangerous to be uncovered? Not conscious. Social, reflexive body language. You can't fake it. Example, yawning perceived as contagious among humans. Oh, every Subject time! Subject observes yawn. Sensory input deactivates left periamygdala region. Subject yawns in response. Social empathy. Also works with dogs. <laughs> Salarian faking signals to discourage curiosity, similar to human faking a yawn. Can try, but... Effectiveness limited. Every time he brings it up, I yawn. I can't help myself just seeing the word. I'm glad you got to talk to family before we finish this. And I'm glad we talked too, Morden. Honored to be part of this, Shepard. Helped preserve Galaxy before with Genophage. Dirty work. Ethically ambiguous. Problematic. Collector's mission simpler. Clean. Oh, yeah. We'll be proud to see it in Morton's Solus biography bit. Unless we all die. Proud posthumously, in that case, Meh. regardless. Thank you. Morton is great. I love Morton. <laughs> Let me just be super articulate about that. Love, love that guy. Love that guy. Good guy. Very smart. Very Solarian. Very cool. See how this goes. Didn't expect you to light up that base, Shepard. Hell of a way to tell the boss you're quitting. I wish I could have seen his face. It's not over, though. Bad guys on the rise. Bad guys. And now Cerberus wants your tail. Never boring, huh? I don't know what kind of time we have, but we better dust off and stay ready. You sure as hell know how to make enemies. Uh, your chat? I'm interested in getting to know you better. Already? Okay. I'm not big on forcing these talks, Shepard. Let's do this later. Did we already do this? Wow, my computer keeps freaking out. We'll talk later. Like, Commander. Once during a recording, and every recording so far, the last little bit, the whole screen like seems to shake on the laptop. I'm really hoping it's not indicative of a larger issue. Because uh, if it is, then uh, all these recordings are screwed, and I'm just going to cry just gonna sit or sit around and look at my computer screen and never play these games again <laughs> hey Shepard glad that collector Reaper crap is over it is over well, the right? collector stuff is uh... it's never over. <laughs> it's never I assume everything's going well up here Edie and I are just enjoying the calm before the shitstorm commander that's it for now see you commander yes Shepard I want to know more about you. Do you have a specific inquiry? Hmm. Never mind, I guess. That's all for now. Logging you out, Shepard. I just took the most expensive ship and AI and myself away from Cerberus. They poured so much money into me. But you can do it the other way where you can end friendly. You can definitely end friendly with Cerberus and they will, um... People will react different. I can't remember how everybody reacts to you. Uh, 
to you not destroying it to handing it over to handing the info over um but i'm not sure like it might just be a thing where they're like oh yeah that was a, a tough decision but it was it was good in the end or if they're all like that was a bad decision it's also kind of surprising that all of them agree with me i would assume that there would be some that would have reservations you know that's how they do it in dragon age which i like like not everybody will agree with your every decision you know Ilium. Let's go. All right. Oh my god! I just, I gosh! I just realized, like, all four of the, my most, well, probably my most favorite people are snipers. Like, I knew it was these three, like Thane, Legion, and Zaid, but I hadn't really been taking Garrus out. But then I was like, maybe I'll take Garrus out and Thane, of course. And now I'm just like, everybody's a sniper. I have a type. I have a type. Um, ba -ba -bum. actually, let's just bring out the OG squad. I can't, I'm pretty sure most of who we have to deal with on, with the DLC is organic. I can't imagine I would get enough points is also is level 30 i think level 30 is yeah level 30 is a max yeah okay is it really that's right because in mass effect one the old max was 60 and then they changed it a bit where it's you could get 30 um in the the updated version and i think i did that this time i decided to go with that just to try it out um yeah, sweet. How diggity. Look at these people. Look at this squad. We're just destined for greatness. We're beautiful. There she is. The daughter of my true love. The council thought the blast my ship. <laughs> <laughs> my plane. Oh, I should have changed. Dang it, I should have changed my stupid. And kindle this. I should have uh, changed my heavy weapon. Shepard, it's good to see you again. So, what can I do for you? One sec, let me save. I'll talk to you later, Liara. Could you imagine Shepard just walks in? Can I? Oh, sure, yeah, I guess. Sure, why not? Can't do it. Yeah, okay, we're good. Um, I'm going to save. And then. And then. We'll go. Shepard, it's good to see you again. So, what can I do for you? I know you're looking for the Shadow Broker. Cerberus gave me data on where to find him. Interested? Absolutely. I had no idea. Let me see what you've got. It looks like a leaked transmission between oh, Shadow Broker and he's in the comic. Some hint says to the location and... <gasps> yeah, that's her friend. It's about Farron. He's still alive. Who's Farron? He was a friend. He helped me recover your body from the Shadow Broker. Why did the Shadow Broker want my corpse? He was going to sell you to the Collectors, but Farron and I stopped him. Farron sacrificed himself to save me. So... You rescued me. Then how did I end up with Cerberus? Well, they gave me intel to help recover you. They actually put Farron with me in the first place. After I got out, I gave you to them. They said they could bring you back. You kept me out of the Collector's hands. Without you, I couldn't have come back. Thank you. I didn't know how you'd feel when Cerberus restored you. If you'd feel betrayed or... They brought you back, and now they're giving me a chance to find Farron. After two years, I hadn't even dreamed. Are those my dog tags or her dog tags? 
Sounds like you and Farron were close. It's funny. He betrayed me more than once. He was double dealing for Cerberus, for the Shadow Broker. But in the end, he sacrificed himself for me. I owe him. Any friend of yours is a friend of mine. What's the next step? I... I don't know. I need to prepare to think. I'm going home. Use my terminal if you need any local intel. You okay? I've spent two years plotting revenge. Now I have the chance to make it a rescue. Let me help. I'll come by your apartment. Okay. Hopefully I'll have a plan by then. Thank you, Shepard. Am I gonna spy on her journal? There's terminal. Blah blah blah. I don't. Oh, I was like, I don't know how to get to her, but I'll. I think they have. I actually don't know. Go to the docking area. Okay, I was like in the. In the what you call it, um, for the best first game at the Citadel, you, you could travel via I'm cab, and you can actually on the Citadel now, right? Where you can travel by cab to like different locations, like at least a little bit. Um, and I was like, Ugh. oh wait, I'm going. I went up. I need to I need to go down under Liara's office. Um, but yeah, so I was like, how do I do that in this one? Because you just walk everywhere on oh, Ilium. But. Out by the docking area. Makes sense. That's where I had to travel to get um, some art. It's safe. Off we go. Joker, I need you to come pilot this for me. I don't trust auto flying things. Oh, yeah. Let's bring. I am tempted to bring Garrus though, just because of the old time stuff, like old time's sake, you know? No, let's bring Legion, because I sacrificed a lot of people for <laughs> Legion, so this playthrough we're bringing Legion out. This is a Legion playthrough all the way. Oh yes, give me my... Missile launcher. Classico. El Classico. I think everybody else is good. Yep. Seal off those trace samples and get them back to the lab. We got multiple shots fired. Yeah, techs are going over the place now. Central, we got an open carrier on this end. Switching to a coded relay. What's going on? This is Liara's apartment! Oh my gosh. This area is sealed off. Please step back, ma'am. Sealed off? Why? Someone tried to kill your friend, Commander Shepard. Thank you, officer. Your people are dismissed. Oh, she's a Spectre. You can't do I'm that. I'm pretty sure. Already done. Tila Vasir, Special Tactics and Recon. A Spectre? I heard your status was reinstated. Good. You're one of our most famous operatives. Might even get you to sign my chest plate. Yeah. So, I assume you had business with your friend this evening, Commander. Liara was following a lead on the Shadow Broker. The Shadow Broker? Dangerous enemy to have. She looks very cool. If Liara isn't here, where is she? If I knew that, I wouldn't be sifting through her crap. There's no blood, no body. It looks like Tassoni got away. The sniper didn't plan on her kinetic barrier. Clever girl. Paranoid. But clever. What are the facts so far? About 25 minutes ago, someone took a shot at Tassoni. Note the bullet holes. She stuck around for almost four minutes before leaving the building. Whatever she was doing was important. Did the police find anything when they arrived? Just the mess and the bullet holes. I gave them a gold star for finding the bullet holes. Having her hovering over them must have been terrifying. Liara was expecting me. She would have left a message here. Her office wasn't safe. 
I'm not surprised. Helium is just Omega with expensive shoes. I haven't found anything useful for tracking her down yet. Why are you looking you for her? better than I do. Where would she have hidden her body? Well, I feel like that's an Let me take a look around. I feel like that's an important question we should be asking is why are you looking for her? A specter doesn't get involved in just an average missing person's case. I actually can't remember if this woman is, is good or bad. <laughs> Why is everybody looks like someone didn't like you much either? Why is everybody keeping bits and pieces of me and why is it on display in your living room, Liara? That's a little weird. Oh, a little weird, a little weird. Yeah, that's not the Asari homeworld. I'm not sure what planet that is. It's Ilos. Yeah. Has the causeways. Interesting. Spooky rain and thunder. Honestly, this would be a cool place to do another thing I want to do where you just like sit around and like take ambient videos. The rifle used to do that wasn't standard issue. The kinetic barrier deflected the shots, but they still managed to penetrate the glass. Doctored from the University of Ceres, Avanthesia. She's getting good use out of all that education. Yeah, well, she was an archaeologist, which was a higher a higher calling than an information broker, but here we are. Oh my gosh, she has the best aquarium setup. I I want this one where it's behind my bed, and I also can't wait to have jellyfish and multiple fishes. Although I could have multiple fish now if I could just keep them alive. But the jellyfish come in the next game and I'm stoked. <gasps> hmm. PSR1. That's where she'd put a note. The picture changed when you touched it. It must be keyed to your ID. What does it show now? It's a Prothean dig site. Liara did leave a message. There are a few Prothean looking objects around the apartment. Let's see what we can find. She shouldn't have Prothean relics in here at all. It's fine. It's fine. Anyway, I should probably call this one here. I know we're kind of in the middle of the investigation, but I think this is probably a good stopping point for now. We'll pick back up on the excitement in a little bit. So thank you all so much for watching. I appreciate it. Really quick, I want to say thank you to my patrons, unless I yawn. Um... To all my patrons, but to especially Reese Galito, myself, and to your patron, thank you so much for your support. And an extra special shout out to Christopher and Adam, my two tree chair patrons. Christopher, thank you so, so much for your support. I really do appreciate it a lot. And I hope you're enjoying the Shadow Burger DLC. And a special shout out also to Adam, who I also hope you're enjoying this series if you're watching it. And thank you so, so much for your support. I appreciate it a lot. So thank you all again, and I hope to see you in the next one.